In this video, we'll cover the process of installing the operating system using the Lifecycle Controller Unattended Installation Mode using the USB drive. Launch the Lifecycle Controller homepage. Click Virtual Media and then click Connect Virtual Media. The Initializing Connection dialog box is displayed. Click Virtual Media and then click Map CD DVD to map the device. The connected drive is displayed in the Virtual Media Map CD DVD dialog box. Click Browse to find the preferred drive. And then click Map Device. Click Virtual Media to verify that the connected CD or DVD is mapped to the removable disk. To map the removable disk, click Virtual Media and then click Map Removable Disk. The connected drive is displayed, however, you can select the preferred drive and click Map Device. Click Virtual Media to verify that the connected removable drive is mapped to the removable disk. Click OS Deployment and then click Deploy OS. If the virtual disk is already present, select Go Directly to OS Deployment. However, if the virtual disk is not present, you will be directed to the RAID configuration wizard to create a virtual disk first. You can select Configure RAID first to edit the existing virtual disk attributes or to create a new virtual disk. For more information about how to configure the virtual disk using the Lifecycle UI, watch the RAID configuration video at the Dell Tech Center YouTube channel. Click Next. Select an operating system you want to install from the list of available operating systems. Then click Next. The system loads the relevant drivers to the selected OS. This will take less than 5 minutes to compose the OS drivers. Select Unattended Install as the installation mode and then click Next. Select USB drive. Select the device from the drop down list and type the file path to the unattended XML file. For more information about creating an unattended XML file, refer to the unattended installation of operating systems on Dell PowerEdge servers by using Lifecycle Controller white paper at Dell Tech Center. Then click Next. The OS deployment window is displayed. Please note, if different versions of the OS installation files are stored on any of the USBs, the system may pick an incorrect file during the OS installation. Connect only one USB with the OS configuration file. Click OK. Select the boot mode for installing the selected OS. Click Next. Insert the OS media into the DVD drive attached to the server or map the OS media virtually using the virtual media option from the menu and then click Next. Validating the operating system media will take less than two minutes. Here the summary of the selected options is displayed. Click Finish. The system reboots and starts the installation of a selected operating system. Note: After reboot, you'll be prompted to press any key to start the installation. If the key is not pressed, the system does not proceed with the installation. Once you press any key, the OS installation starts. The OS installation wizard obtains the required information from the unattended XML file and continues with the installation without requiring any manual intervention. For more information on the Dell Lifecycle Controller, visit dell.com forward slash techcenter forward slash lc.